Hi, I'm Malcolm, the developer of Wear Installer 2. I've recently added a new feature to help install apps that need accessibility permission. Today I'm going to show you how to give accessibility permission directly from Wear Installer 2 rather than enabling accessibility on your watch. Firstly, let's do some setup on this watch right here. So go to settings. <coughs> Developer options. Now, if you don't have developer options on your watch, just Google how to enable it. It's very straightforward. And I recommend that you enable stay awake when charging, connect your watch to a charger, and turn on ADB debugging, and turn on wireless debugging. Now, let me bring in my phone and let's go to the Freepot website and let's down the, download this app, ScreenLock Helper, which is an app that needs accessibility permission and we'll install it to the watch right here. So if we open Wear Installer 2, if you haven't used Wear Installer 2 before, there's some explanation here in a video that you can watch, but we'll step through things in this video. The first thing to do is to make sure that the IP address from your watch is entered on Wear Installer 2's home screen, and you can see that it's in this case 192.168.1.217. Your IP address will be different from that. You can see that I've already entered it here, so we can press done. And now we need to pair the watch and the phone over ADP. So pair with watch. And there's some more explanation here, which you can read at your leisure, but enable. And on the watch, pair new device. And we'll see there's a pairing code and a pairing port, and we can enter those here. So first the pairing code, 924186, and then a space, and then the pairing port, which is shown after the IP address. So 35389. Press done. I get a message attempting to pair and then successfully paired. Now, this next step is important to remember. The random port that's shown after the IP address needs to go in this space provided in Wear Installer 2. So we can see that it's 33975. Done. And now if we go to custom APK, we'll see a list of all the APK files in our download folder. And screen lock helper underscore where is here. That's the one we downloaded just a moment ago from my website. So let's tap on that. We get a message to say this APK file is for, is for Wear OS. That's good. Continue. And install. So it's sending the APK file from the phone to the watch and it's done. And now this is the new, the new part. Wear Installer 2 automatically determines that this app, ScreenLock Helper in this case, needs accessibility permission and we can enable it here by just tapping send. And so it sent the command to the watch to enable accessibility we can press finish and we get a reminder to turn off ADB debugging on the watch. That's important to do to save battery. So we'll turn it off. Turn off ADB debugging. Turn off stay awake when charging. And now let's just go to accessibility and check. We scroll down. We should find screen lock helper. And we can see ScreenLock Helper has been installed and accessibility has been 
granted. So you can find Screen Lock Helper, Where Installer 2, and my other free apps at my Freepot website. And I've put a link in the notes below this video. That's about it for now. Thanks for watching and see you again soon.